CBD oil, Parkinson's dyskinesia. Parkinson's disease is a cruel, life-robbing condition where parts of the brain become progressively damaged over the years. This results in uncontrollable tremors, loss of movement, which is known as dyskinesia, and ultimately, severe disability and death. Though millions of people around the world suffer from the condition, very little is known about what causes it, and there is currently no cure, only treatments that may be able to ease symptoms. Recently, cannabidol oil, or CBD oil, as it is often shortened to, has been shown clinically to be a promising treatment for Parkinson's disease. In this video, we look at the scientific evidence, and be sure to watch to the end, where we explain how to take the oil in the correct way to give therapeutic benefits. In a previous video by Better Days, we explained why some of the health claims surrounding CBD oil are false and why it is critically important that you buy a quality CBD product that will not give you any adverse side effects. A link to this video is provided in the description below this one and also in the end of this video. We highly recommend you watch that episode after this one to protect yourself from unscrupulous sellers. Can CBD oil help with Parkinson's disease? Medical researchers have begun to show enthusiasm to study cannabis as a treatment for Parkinson's disease after countless sufferers have given anecdotal reports of how cannabis has greatly reduced their tremors. If you look on YouTube or search on Google, you will find testimonial after testimonial of Parkinson's sufferers who claim cannabis oil has reversed their symptoms and given them back their life. Now, some medical researchers believe that cannabis might be neuroprotective, which means it has the ability to save neurons from damage caused by Parkinson's disease. Have clinical trials been done, and what did they show? Yes, clinical trials have started to emerge. The Department of Neurology at the UK's Manchester Royal Infirmary has performed a randomized, double-blind, placebo-controlled trial looking at the effect of cannabinoids on Parkinson's sufferers. This type of medical trial is the gold standard in clinical research, and its results are generally considered reliable. The trial found that nabilone, a type of receptor which is found in cannabinoids, significantly reduces dyskinesia in Parkinson's disease. Remember that dyskinesia is the restriction of movement and one of the most debilitating effects of Parkinson's disease. For a double-blind study to describe the improvement in patients as significant is very encouraging. Another study on the effects of cannabinoids on Parkinson's disease was published in the International Review of Neurobiology. It discovered that marijuana contains over 100 neuroactive chemicals that work with two types of cannabinoid receptors. Type 1, which is located in the brain, and type 2, which is in both the brain and immune system. Cannabinoids were found to have a powerful effect on these receptors. People with Parkinson's disease are known to have less type 1 receptors than people who do not have the condition. The report found that a boost to type 1 receptors through a substance such as marijuana can improve tremors and alleviate dyskinesia. So here we have two separate mechanisms described in the scientific literature that point to the effectiveness of cannabinoids in alleviating Parkinson's disease. How should I take CBD oil? The method which appears to show most promise, particularly in the self-reported results, is sublingual consumption. This is where a few drops of CBD oil are placed under the tongue for a few minutes. This method is effective because the oil is easily absorbed by the tissue and quickly gets into the bloodstream. The CBD oil is usually effective within only a few minutes. Many consultants and general practitioners are now becoming more open to using CBD oil as a complementary treatment for Parkinson's. So it's worth talking to your doctor about what symptoms you are experiencing and how you could find relief by incorporating CBD oil into your treatment plan. Are there any side effects? In most studies, CBD oil is well tolerated. A high quality oil rarely causes side effects. And if they do occur, they tend to be mild, such as tiredness, changes in appetite, and diarrhea. 
However, it is critically important that you find a quality CBD oil source to avoid any harmful effects. And we encourage you to watch the video linked at the end of this one to learn about some of the dangers of this unregulated market. If you liked this video, please subscribe to Better Days, where we deliver fun and informative videos that help you become the best version of you. Till next time, have a great day.